In this video, I'll go over how to automatically remove unused Docker images left on your Synology NAS using a scheduled task. This video is a follow-up on my previous video on using Watchtower to notify you of Docker updates on a Synology NAS, as well as a direct response to this comment by viewer Gaming Out Loud, where it was asked if it is possible to start an automated cleanup routine of unused images. For some background, when Watchtower is set up to only notify you of new Docker images, it downloads the image for you to manually update the corresponding Docker container. Then, from the Docker package within DSM, you can go through the steps of updating the container to make use of the new image. However, the Docker package doesn't give you a way to remove or prune the old unused image and would require you to use the command line to run the sudo docker image prune command to clean up the image. To get past this limitation with the docker package, as well as to provide a way to automate the removal of old, unused images without requiring the use of the command line, we can make use of the task scheduler available through DSM. To do this, you'll need to go to control panel, then bring up task scheduler. Here I'll click on Create, select Schedule Task, then User Defined Script. I'll give the task a name, set the user to root, and make sure the script is enabled. Next, I'll switch over to the Schedule tab, and for me, I think running this cleanup script once a week is sufficient, so I'll set it to run each week on Sunday at midnight. I'll then bring up the Task Settings tab, and in the User Defined Script box, I'll enter in Docker Image Prune F, which is the command to remove any unused images. The dash F option is added so you don't get prompted for confirmation, which makes automating the command possible. As an optional step, you can also enable Send Run Details by email, which I'll enable in my setup. I'll enter in an email address that I want to receive the email notification, and I'll make sure the box to send run details only when the script terminates abnormally is unchecked because I'd like to receive a weekly report of what images were pruned from my Synology NAS. I'll then click OK and OK again on this warning window on running commands with root permissions. To test to make sure the newly created task works as expected, I'll select it from the list of scheduled tasks and click on the Run box. I'll select Yes from this confirmation pop-up window, and because email notification has been set up, I get a confirmation through my email showing me what images have been deleted and how much disk space was freed up with the removal of the unused images. Watchtower can also automate the entire process of updating Docker containers when new images are available, which the first video listed here on screen goes over. Or check out the second video on setting up an email notification when new Docker images are available, which I referenced earlier in this video. Lastly, consider supporting my work by checking out the Support This Channel section in the description below. Thanks so much for watching.